In this video, we will try to explain the wasted uh, patient's efforts due to low sensitivity level. So you if you have this patient who is on pressure support mode of ventilation, with a pressure support set at 10 centimeter of water, the machine will be triggered by the patient. However, the patient has to reach a certain value that is set by the physician and you can go to additional settings here go to flow trigger and you can see that the patient has to generate at least 5.7 liters per minute of inspiratory flow before he's able to trigger the ventilator to deliver that pressure support of 10 centimeter of water so in this breath here you can see the patient was able to generate that 5.7 liters similarly in this breath here the patient is able to generate 5.7 you can see it clearer here and let me freeze it for you so this is the initial rise of the flow that is due to patient's effort he reached the threshold at this point here and then the pressure is increased from the peep level of 5 to the level of 15 after adding 10 centimeter of water now every time the machine is triggered the patient should at least generate 5.7 liters per minute now take a look on this breath here what you see is the patient had some initial inspiratory efforts here and in fact he generated inspiratory flow and you can see the the inspiratory volume however that inspiratory flow was less than 5.7 liters so he could not trigger the ventilator and that's why you don't see any pressure support given with this inspiratory effort so this is what we call wasted effort in order to eliminate any wasted effort you need to decrease that you need to increase the sensitivity or decrease the trigger threshold so as i said it was set at 5.7 so we need to go down on the threshold let's say down to three liters per minute so this way we are increasing the sensitivity of the triggering mechanism now the patient has to generate only three liters per minute of inspiratory flow in order to trigger the ventilator you don't need to set this value very low so if it is set at very low value any patient's movement or any air movement will result into a triggering of the ventilator this could be uh, physicians listening to the chest or a nurse moving uh, the patient to one side any inspiratory or expiratory flow the machine will detect it as a flow change and it will be triggered with inspiratory breath thank you